Hey guys, Jordy MP3 here, and today we'll be talking about how to run Black Ops 3 on a low powered system that is under the minimum requirements to play uh, Black Ops 3. First, you want to remove this from your Black Ops 3 folder and just like put it on your desktop. If you have issues, just put it back. Um, but that will stop some frame drops from happening from it checking for DLCs. Next, uh, depending on how bad your game runs, um, change this to whatever you're putting it in game. For me, I put it at just this. I have used the boy client before and my experience with it, I got about the same FPS I'm getting with just doing this. So my frames will probably will not be great uh, in game because uh, I'm recording so normally I get around 60 to 70 FPS. As you can see I have my screen resolution in the game uh, the same resolution I put my computer as. Um, this will help a bunch with your FPS. Um, I saw my frames go from a very inconsistent 40 to a very consistent 60 to 70. Depending on how your game runs, you can change your render resolution lower. Uh, the lowest I would go is 80. Your game will still look good, but it will help with FPS. I have my field of view maxed out. You don't need to do that. You might even find that you'll have better FPS if you lower this. I have my max frames per second at 240. I have these two uh, turned off. Every time I have them on, uh, it makes my frames lower. On my advanced settings, I have texture and texture filtering at low. You can have your texture quality at high uh, or medium. It doesn't change your frame rate much, but I prefer the couple frames I get from it. Mesh quality makes just the game look a little bit better, so I have it at high. Shadow map quality, if you have it lower than medium, then your shadows will look horrible, so have it at least medium. All these settings I have turned off. Anti-aliasing, I have it on SMAA T2X. I have a multi GPU system, so I, I don't touch these ones. I have motion blur and ambient occlusion off. Also, something you might find is that you'll have more FPS in game than you do in the menus. I don't know why, it's just something to mention. But I have loaded up a pretty demanding map just to test. As I said before, though, my FPS is going to be probably lower than if I was just not recording, so that in mind. So yeah guys, that's how you um, increase the FPS on uh, Black Ops 3, um, specifically more for zombies, that's what I play, um, without any clients, without anything to download, uh, it's just purely the game itself. 